sunny Saturday morning and welcome back to Throttle Curious. Today we are continuing our documentation of how to have fun with your car and ironically one of the leading ways people have fun with their cars is to not drive them at all. You take them to a parking lot early in the morning on a Saturday, you park them next to a bunch of other cars owned by car nerds and you drink coffee and you talk about them. This phenomenon is known as cars and coffee. Today we're gonna to go to one of the best cars and coffees in the country. That's at the M1 Concourse here in Pontiac, Michigan. M1 Concourse is a very cool racetrack, private car garage, uh, essentially automotive community. It's a very cool spot. It's actually on the property of an old General Motors plant. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna go drink some coffee, talk to some car nerds, and look at some cool cars. gearhead meditation right here.
doing so much to ourselves this morning. FJ
doing? Good morning. Hey, uh, just take a right and park on either side of the track. All right, no skid pad today? Um, are, are you a gr garage club member? I am not. Club? Uh, no, no, you're on the track. Okay. We are here. So this is the racetrack here at M1. Thank you. Hit the dance floor Don't work too hard My break a backbone Return of the Mac The king is back though Corvette and cash I never like those She saw the stone You know how that go Fatality My diamonds that cold Versace trunks I hit my backstroke Knock on the door She at the back bro All I really take Is a little taste Allen girl Blue eyes with a little bass Here for the thrill I don't need a chase Sir Wanna vibe it to get away Shimmy shimmy I got the semi four way Don't step out the line Like this a probate You hit the line And try to locate This for the time, got time for no day one Too many, I'm going Too crazy and I got Bad ones and they ready A good time, so now it's In the whip, we left the ass Can't remember anything But I know we got late Who are you? My name's Lane Lane, I'm Fred Fred, nice to meet you This is your uh, Ford GT here? Yes Could you tell me a little bit about the car? So it started its life as a 2005 Ford GT chassis got a, got a vitamin water that we acquired from Ford Performance several years ago. I actually, we actually have 30 of them. Wow. 30 chassis. And then, <laughs> and then we acquired the body molds from a Swiss racing team from Geneva that homologated the car and raced it at Le Mans 2011. Wow. Then we, we updated the aero just to make it a little bit more current because we're not adhering to any rules. We're able to kind of do whatever we want. That was going to ask, are you building it to any spec or just kind of trying to make it as cool as... Like an M1 or other... The goal is for other track clubs, hopefully bigger, bigger tracks that can take advantage of <laughs> what we built. So then we went to Roush Yates and basically uh, we have an RY45 27 7 liter uh it's a derivative of the uh, current uh, nascar engine <laughs> that's so cool but it has the aluminum block and um it has twin garrets okay so how much uh boost are you running through it on this car because it's running set up for this track right now i have four pounds of boost okay. <laughs> at wow. 1100 at the wheels wow um it's we can get 15 plus. Okay. If the customer wants that. Gotcha. So it's set up. This is essentially it's an ultimate dream track day car. Yeah, it's got more power than you need, <laughs> and it's uh, six inches wider than a street car, and two and a half inches longer than a street car. So everything is completely modified for optimized performance, track performance. Wow. So how much, how many hours of carbon fiber work would you think is into this car so far? My, the guy that's doing this is a company called Synergy Composites out of Canada. And he says he's got 6,000 hours. <laughs> Not counting the fact that he started with molds, existing okay. molds. So that's. Yeah. That's the redo and the refinement and and adding new parts that weren't originally uh, on the Matex mold. Very cool. Yeah. Well, Fred, I appreciate your time and tell me about the car. It's it's one of those. It's just 
I love carbon plus go fast and not building it to any kind of race spec. Yeah. That's the kind of lunacy I love. It's just yeah. like we're out here to have fun and make cool stuff. So, so. Uh, Instagram is GT1 Carbon. Okay. And the name of the company is GT1. Okay. Is there a website? GT1Carbon.com. Yes. Okay. okay. But it's just to be clear, it is not a Ford GT. It yep. is a GT1. That's very cool. I want to make that disclaimer. That is. Thank you. Thank you, Fred, man. That was very. Thanks for spending some time. Too many, I'm going. Too crazy, and I got bad ones, and they ready. A good time, so now it's in the whip. We left that. Can't remember anything, but I know we got lit. Think I'm seeing things. Read the line in mid between. Yellow light, I gotta speed up. Get home to a cold shower. Need that pronto. Look, look, look like a rave at the condo. Heck of a night in Toronto. Shad boy, you Morocco. Pearl white mansion in the top go. Fill up my cup with the pop woke. High off life in the spot though. Running at the visa. Really talking to a real life Mona Lisa. Jesus pieces hanging off the fleece. So much going on, it's hard to focus on the features. I got one. Too many, I'm going. Too crazy, and I got bad ones, and they ready. A good time, so now it's in the way we left us. Can't remember anything, but I know we got lit. was a great morning at Cars and Coffee. I highly recommend if you're ever near Detroit at all on a Saturday morning, first Saturday of the month, come out and check it out. Till next time, 